It is the exact opposite. It is sulfur axle fluoride. That's what this is what this is. Sulfur and six fluorine atoms. What? I am. I am going to ingest way too many valence electrons. But hey, hey, before before I do this, let's talk about this for a second. Okay, would I be better off inhaling this or that uh, boron trifluoride? Because this has an an excess of valence electrons, so it's not going to try to bond with a lot of things in my body, right? <laughs> read, read, read the warning. Here's the warning. First aid, if inhaled, remove to fresh air. If not breathing, give artificial respiration. If breathing is difficult, give oxygen. <laughs> Oh, Miss Genoways is going to come give me mouth to mouth if I pass out. So clear a path. Clear a path. What? All right. You can't do it. All right, you ready? We rolling? Okay, here we go. Okay, when you breathe in sulfur hexafluoride, you will notice that it has the opposite effect of helium gas. Because the gas is denser than air, so the sound waves travel slower, thus lowering the pitch. Anything else you'd like to hear me say? I cannot sing the, ele the element song. Notice that it, it's starting to kind of, but uh, that's kind of cool. Uh, it's kind of wearing off. All right. No, no, I can't do it again. <laughs> All right, it's gone.